Good morning, my little chicken nuggets. It is the week after the dinner theater, or the week where we get to get back to normal a little bit. What a great show we had this year. It was a terrific performance by our students. Great job by Miss Douglas uh, directing the show, and great job by all of our teachers uh, helping out during the week. I was going to say that was a great, Beauty and the Beast is a great story. It's a great Disney story. We really enjoyed it. Uh, but we know that it's not real. We know that it's not um, a true story. So it is always important to remember that entertaining stories and stories like Disney stories are great and they mean a lot, but they're not the true stories. And I wanted to put this little video in here of Shepard because he does such a great job of explaining a story that is real. So watch this. Who is it? Nebuchadnezzar. Nebuchadnezzar. Um, and what did Nebuchadnezzar do? Put him in the fire. Who was put in the fire? Uh, I don't know. Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego? And there was an angel. There was an angel. And what did the angel do? Saved them. He saved them. And there was this was in Smell like smoke. Didn't smell like smoke. Mm -mm. And were they saved? Yep. Why were they put into the fire? Because Nebuchadnezzar said, Nope, I'm not going to pray to this statue. Nobody should have prayed to the statue, huh? Nope. Nope. We don't. We Was that a hot fire? Yeah. Yeah? Should it have burned them? No. They did it. If... If there was no angel in there, would it have burned them? Yes. Yeah, but that angel did what? Help them. Mm -hmm, because why? Because they, and Nebuchadnezzar didn't wish it. And, and, and they were, and they were using a true, a real God. Yeah, they believed in the true God, right? Uh huh. Who is the true God? The God. Our God, right? Uh-huh. Yeah, that's such a good story. Good job. You told it very well. Yeah, but I didn't know those names. That's okay. They have funny names. You want to call them Rack, Shack, and Benny? Uh, yeah. Can you say that? Rack, Shack, and Benny. I like it. <laughs> um, I can open this. As you can see, Shepard did a great job of of telling the story that he learned at school and, and at church. So as great as Beauty and the Beast was, and kids, you did a terrific job. Just remember that God has given us his word so that we can learn about him and grow in our faith. First Corinthians 10 tells us that these things, being the Old Testament stories, were written for our benefit so that we can have faith and we can trust in God. And I pray that you'll learn more about him every day and that you'll learn to trust him more every day and that you will be the man or woman of God that he created you to be. So right now, enjoy these highlights from the show, and y'all have a great weekend. See you later, my little chicken nuggets.
Oh, wow. Uh, it's like that's special and good. 